Good morning, Titan family. My name is Gianna. And my name is Natalia. And we'd like to welcome you to Titan Connect. Please stand for pledge. Put your left hand by your side and your right hand over your chest. I pledge allegiance to, to the, the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for dress code check. You may be seated. And now for Titan Strong. Good morning, Titan family. Good morning. Happy Monday. All right. So um, I love when we get to celebrate some awesome kids. And, and we this, have a lot of awesome We students. have a whole stack here of awesome kids. Um, now, some people probably are absent, so we'll still recognize them whenever, um, whenever we go through their names on their certificates. Um, so if they're, if you do like ha happen to hear this and you're in your home room, come on down to the Titan Connect room because we'd still like to take your picture, okay? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start with our first Titan Strong Award. This one is for Gabe Ortega in on the sixth grade Atlas team. Gabe is a very polite young gentleman. He tries his best in all that he does. He is respectful to his teachers and classmates. Gabe always ends his day with telling us bye and have to have a good afternoon. Are you Gabe? Come on over Gabe, all right. And then if you will just stand like right there we go to where, to where we can still see you. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. All right, you want to read the... Awesome. All right. From sixth grade Oceanus team, we have Talia Mack. Talia, come on down. <laughs> Talia's wonderful team said that she is a wonderful student. Not only is she very smart, she is always helpful and willing to learn. Congratulations. Thank you. All right. From sixth grade Helios, we have Aldo. Come on down, Aldo. All right. His team wanted to recognize him for um, for Titan Strong, and I will get you your certificate soon, but we wanted okay. to make sure that we recognize you. Come stand right here, okay? All right. All right. From seventh grade Atlas team, we have Rylan Myers. Is Rylan here with us? We'll clap for him anyway. Yay, Rylan. So seventh grade Atlas team says Rylan displays an other people mindset and teamwork daily. Rylan works well with all students and makes an effort to include everyone. Rylan can be seen helping classmates gather their belongings, putting calculators back, holding the door, picking up trash, and so much more. Rylan is respectful of his classmates' opinions and ideas, which demonstrates his open-mindedness. Rylan is a kind, hardworking student, and we are so excited to have him represent the Atlas team as our Titan Strong Award. That's so awesome. way to go, Rylan. Yeah. All right, our next one is BJ Spencer from seventh grade Helios team. Um, BJ works well with his peers. He is a leader in the classroom and holds his peers accountable during group work. He receives feedback and makes adjustments without argument. He is responsible and maintains a good attitude. BJ does what he should do, even when he thinks that nobody's looking. That is way to go, that's BJ. That's character. Good job, yes. BJ. Yes. This one I know we do have. We do. All right, from seventh grade Oceanus team, we have Piper Mitchell. Hey, Piper. Hey, Piper. All right, Piper. So the team says that Piper is such a well-rounded student. Her love for NCMS shines through by being both on the cheerleading squad and a member of student council. She is such a great classroom helper to both teachers and students alike. Congratulations. 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 All right. For eighth grade Atlas team, we have Lily Tobar. Lily is reasonable, humble, and kind in her teamwork activities and daily interactions with her peers and staff. Lily, come on up. She is honest and positive in her outlook. She is a positive influence who strives to do good in the classroom and community. Every day she brings her best and represents her family and Northwest in a manner that is worthy of a Titan. Lily is truly an honor to teach and more importantly, an honor to know. Wow, Ooh. that's nice words there, Lily. All right. All right. From eighth grade Helios team, we have Cole Wedner. Come on down, Cole. All right, so Cole is an exemplar titan. He is respectful, responsible, and safe in all of his classes. Cole engages in his classwork, shows curiosity with what he's learning, and works wonderfully as a teammate who supports his classmates. Well done, Cole. All right, great job. You guys, can we squeeze, like, just try to squeeze in so everybody can everybody's face can be seen here. All right, uh, eighth grade Oceanus team, we have Makayla Suleiman. Good job, Makayla. Come on down. 
Micaiah is a strong role model for her peers. She consistently works hard and puts her best effort forward. She is kind and always willing to help anyone who needs it. She is responsible, can be trusted, and her character never wavers. Micaiah is the definition of a true titan. Way to go, Micaiah. And then I think our two we guys do. over there, they came. So. so let's have Rylan Myers come on down and BJ Spencer Way come on go, down. guys. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for coming down. I think we have a full house of all we Titan do. Strong kids. I love it. This I is love fantastic. It. So uh, remember to try to strive to do all those P2 characteristics that you're learning about every week, um, and just you know be an awesome Titan, and you too could possibly be up here next quarter. All right. Yay. So why don't we have them walk that way so we can get everybody's, everybody's face, face on the screen? All right, sounds good. All yes. Right. Go okay, y'all check it out that way. Wave to all of your wonderful fans out there here you go <laughs> yay congratulations yay. to all of our titan strong winners awesome all yes. right all right I'll see you later Ms. so miss andrews is leaving me leaving you by yourself leaving me all oh, by myself my. so we have this full week and next week we have two days before thanksgiving break but don't start going away on early holiday vacation yet because we've got lots of work and lots of assignments and things to get done so make sure that you're staying strong in second quarter you're getting all of your work done getting it all completed and submitted on time want to let you know that your benchmark reports from when we took our fall benchmarks a couple of weeks ago are going to be going home with you today so you're going to get a report from math ela and if you're in eighth grade you're also going to be getting a report for science what your report says is how you did on the benchmark but also based on how you did it projects what you're able to do on your end of grade test now again that's a projection which means it's not an actual grade that is set so how hard you work and how much effort you apply that number can constantly change and grow during the course of the year so that projected achievement level which is a score between one and five will be posted in uh, power school so that way your parents and guardians can see it so it will be an assignment it will be exempt so it will not count towards your grade however it will be in power school so that way you can see it so your teachers will be going through those benchmark reports with you today if you have any questions about those please do not hesitate to ask all right we have a wonderful great week of learning so with that we're going to finish up and wrap up with making sure that we are being respectful we are being responsible and we are being safe have a great week <laughs>